before we go down to the greenhouse today this is the dehumidifier that I get all of my water for them to uh, add the nutrients back into my hydroponics as we go out here I had a rain barrel or I still have a rain barrel and uh, put it into use before all the pollen had washed away so the first time it rained it washed all the pollen down into the rain barrel and it rotted and I'd put some of the water into some of the plants that were down here in the greenhouse I'll show you the difference between the pure water that comes out of the dehumidifier compared to the rotten water that I got out of the dirty rain barrel and we'll see what difference it makes You can see the plants on this side are doing really well and the water is clear or the tubes clear these over here I didn't have enough water out of the dehumidifier and had to use the water out of the rain barrel much dirtier plants much smaller I don't know that tomato plant over there is starting to kick in but I've also added uh, fresh nutrients with the water out of the dehumidifier into it because it had used you can see the levels low it probably needs a little bit more it sucked most of that dirty water out and I've already been replenishing it with uh, the clean dehumidifier water and you can see the potato plant is just hell it, it could be as tall as many buckets as I put on it I think I'm going to stop right there and just see if See if I get three buckets of potatoes, I'll be happy with that. See if we can't get back here. We got beans and peas and squash. I don't know what's up with that squash plant. It ran out of nutrients and I added some more yesterday. Hopefully the color will come back, but we'll see. Plenty of tomatoes on everything. Got some bigger tomatoes over here. Some peppers. This pepper plant's doing really well. Uh, the bush beans are starting to put on blooms. Got some more pepper plants down here. There's some soil. They're doing okay. I'm going to move them outside before long if they get much taller. We've got some strawberries here that need to be picked. I'll pick those right after I get through shooting this video. There's probably some in here too. There's a few. But anyway, that's the update. And uh, we'll see. I think that tomato plant there is going to outgrow them all. We'll see.